Well, we got all the bands coming out. Yep, they, there goes the OD and Void actually go out from Chaos. Night Stalker, they're not dealing with that hero again. And the Ember. And man, 178, they're not going to have any reserve time left pretty soon. They're at about yep. 35. Yeah. Those, those are good bands, though, right? Like uh, the, uh, the OD for like the setup for the arrow. You don't want like super easy rotations mid. Whoa. Is that the so it is the three Ogre again, and we are going to have the Raptor. Yep. One of the few fives that, like, I mean, it's it's pretty obvious, right? You got Coddles and Chens, and then, like, a tier below, you start getting to the other heroes. How good do you guys think Disruptor is? It still seems like really only CIS is picking it per yeah. normal. Yes, like, you can only really run them when you play, like, very aggressive lineups. Like, you run at them, you kill a guy, and then they kind of try to get away. You glimpse another guy back, yeah. you just well, snowball you need, with it. You need vision-based heroes, too. Like, you, you need do. TA, you need Night Stalker or something to make it work. You yep. got uh, an arrow. And then you have to also try not to lane versus heroes that have dispels, because then you can't even use Thunderstrike. Mm -hmm. I think the laning phase for this hero is really rough. It's terrible. Yeah. Like, you, you have this, like, single-target nuke that you're hoping to trade out, but uh, you have no offensive catch. You don't pressure the offlaner very much, so you need some hero that can just, like, do things by himself. He's just, his ultimate is just, like, worse coddle until you get an eggs or something, but it's another one of these situations where it's like, yeah, these heroes will be good if they can get over that early yeah. game hump. Yeah. But a five hero needing yeah. that stuff is real rough. And a life stealer, obviously, it sounds like. I mean, you're going against a Sand King Lesh. They just need something that wouldn't die. Yeah, I mean, yes. even that lane is not easy for Lesh either. Yeah, like he gets stunned twice. They're also removing one of the heroes that can counter glimpse. Yeah. Oh. So your chaos. You don't have last pick this time. Do you? Do you take a Quinn hero here instead of a Yawar? They could just take the Jug if they want. I don't know if it's even necessary, but it feels kind of good versus Disruptor, and he is free spin TP right now. We'll see, because they're going to use all their reserve time. That first that first game, it felt like both teams were just going. I guess you, you have a plan going into game one most times, right? Game two, it switches up, and they do take, they take the, the TA for Quinn again. Really good against Lifesteal there. Yep. Once you get this Deso up, he actually just melts. He does. Well, melts, strike. <laughs> melt. Indeed. <laughs> do you guys melt your butter in the microwave, or do you just sit it out and do it naturally? I've never... What? 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 Like, you, you dude, there's no way you put it in the microwave. You it's just gonna okay, be okay. Like you're not gonna like if it's in the fridge and well, you're yeah. trying to like get it for your toast. Well, like, would it? No, oh, you just, it, it you would just be on the counter if it was butter. Okay. Yeah. What about margarine? I just pull that stuff Wait, out of the fridge. You don't, you don't, oh. re uh, you don't refrigerate butter. There's no well, way you, you don't. like take it out in the morning, put it in the little tray. There, there's no way you remember that, dude. Yeah. Like you definitely. Like, I want to I mean, toast. I'm a margarine guy, no. but dude, you're like I want to toast. Let me get out the butter. It's not like, let me get out the butter for the toast later. Dude, margarine's just the easy life. <laughs> Give me those plastic chemicals. Yeah, you're slacks. I yeah, so I was, I That's my life. Oh. I just back Dude, someone left us. a juice box in the freezer, by the way. It was about <laughs> to explode. That shit was throbbing in there, and I, I took it out. I was like, what the hell? Yeah, some you're real truly weirdos a hero here. <laughs> yeah, I had to save it, but. What, what about cheese, though? Cheese in the microwave is legit. Like well, yeah, that's – how else toast? would you melt it? I don't think it would melt sitting on a table. I don't know how you do it in Europe if you just put, like, <laughs> chips and cheese on a counter. You put it in the sun. <laughs> leave it outside for half an hour. Dude, come dude, back. Chips and cheese is not a thing in Europe. What? It's not a thing. Well, what, well like nachos. Yeah, we, we don't have those. Oh, yeah, you don't have Mexican food. Yeah. Truly the biggest fault of the European continent. It's up there. It uh, is up I'm there. pretty sure it's not the only one, but, yeah, lots yeah. of – it's probably a big one. What do they ban? They ban a Huskar, so Quinn's like, nope, I'm not dealing with that. Yeah, Take no it out. Thanks. Last okay. pick. You are a hero. Do you need something that maybe goes through the, the life stealer here? Slark. Is there anything? I think the, uh, Chaos Knight. the draw ban wow. was good, and then they're just like, oh, yeah, this looks pretty good this game, guys. Yep. And they take the CK, I think, a Quincy crew or Chaos before in the Quilbert. They're one of the only teams actually picking CK yep. for a while. Sumail really loved that hero, obviously not on the team anymore, but. Ember Spirit? It's banned. I think he's oh, gone. Oh, it's banned. They banned it themselves. Well, that's a yikes for me. <laughs> what do you do now? I think you just leave. Lash Rack's taken by the enemy team as a support, which yeah. one of the other heroes that looks AOE like AOE damage from the mid lane. It has to be. Do we got Alina still? Is that too squid? That is so. Look at your team. You are a squishy team besides that ogre. Because you said Life Stealer's not that tanky of a hero. Yeah. Like, he has rage, but if you just right click him, he dies. What about Zeus? Is Zeus versus Tia just unplayable? Yeah. Okay, no Zeus then. <laughs> yeah, other than it's that, really it, looks, it looks okay, but yeah, the lane is just Let me just, just say, bad. it doesn't feel good to play. Dude, I played it in a pub, and I crushed that kid as Zeus. Might be a little different than playing against <laughs> Quinn TA, but... <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is good. Right. AoE damage, we'll get the tiny Dude, Quinn, Aghanims. Quinn way back then, didn't he solo Miracle? 
at yeah. a summit. He did. That was that was when you know I don't want to say that I bought them into the summit when but, they were but FDL, but I did. <laughs> I actually you know jump started Quinn's career. It's How much money but, did you pay? A uh, thousand one hundred, I believe. Dang, that's oh, a lot. Man. For what? Uh, to when you could buy people into the summit, you know, pay oh, money and get yeah. it. And I, 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 I beat out like at the last second. You I paid ham. extra money and beat yeah. out the Chinese team. Yep. yep. Yeah, you went ham. I remember. You beat that. an entire country. Yes, I did. <laughs> Sometimes you just do <laughs> it. All right, well, Grant. It sounds like we're all fa are we all favoring chaos's draft again? Because it sounds like we're struggling to think about a mid hero. And if you're struggling to think about a last pick middle, that that can't be good, right? I, I'm just not no? really in on this disruptor. The Disruptor and the Ogre are you taking away my faith. But you can glimpse an illusion and it dies instantly. That's true. And then you get that town at, what is it, 25, where it uh. removes the cooldown by a bunch? I and mean, you can um, glimpse two illusions. Yeah. There it is. Blitz, That's you, gave me a you gave me a weird face when I said that. You, you kind of like 178's draft? No, or? I think Chaos oh. is going to win. Okay. I didn't mean to give you a weird face. Oh, okay. bad, dude. No, it's all right. Made me feel a little bad, but no, I'm just kidding. You guys agree? Chaos is looking a, a little bit favored going into this. I mean, yep. it's always easy after a first game like that, but then when they get some of the same heroes and you you don't really see the counters, you don't really see a lot of change. You think the big problem hero from the previous game is still just there on both sides, be it the Caudal for Chaos and the Ogre for 178, then I have a hard time going for 178 here. There's potential. They could run them over, you know. Tiny kills a guy and then glimpsed back the other guy, and then the third guy comes in to help the second guy, and then all three are dead. The problem is that running over tends to mean that you won lanes. I mean, just win lanes. Lol. Whoa! Lol. We're gonna have a quick pause. Saberlight needs to do it. <laughs> there has been very few pauses actually so far here. Right? Only about three or four of them, and we are gonna see. They're just gonna fix it up really quick, and I don't know. So when's the best timing for this dire? Someone's chasing Slacks, and I think he went behind the barrier. Yeah. They need to control these people. I feel like he's he might be playing Street Punk. That is entirely possible. I thought only Bullock and I do that. Would you like to explain Street Stand Pong in front to of the this. people? What? He has a mic? Who put his mic on? Hey, hold on. <coughs> oh, breathe. He doesn't know he's live right now. <laughs> Yo, Slacks, we can hear you. Hello. 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 Hello there. Hey. Hi, guys. <laughs> Where are you? Is it working? <laughs> we have a pause, so this My is... My God, the voice of well God timed. sounds a lot worse than I thought it would. <laughs> Hi, everybody. We're here in the mini-map taking a look at the game. Sir, what lanes do you think they'll be in? Oh, I think they're going to be in all the lanes, Slacks. <laughs> Very informative, <laughs> sir. Point to where mid should get a last hit. It should be over here. Where's the first last hit? The, la the first creep's gonna die right there. On the mini map, That's or? <laughs> That's like Get the hell out of the screen! Run! <laughs> Run! Our time's over! <laughs> well, thanks for that. I have no clue what that was, but we got some help, and apparently heroes are gonna be going to lanes, so it looks like he's Man. ruling out the jungling. That's good. All lanes. Yes, so no jungling. Weatherman Purge just got upgraded. He did. We got him in the game now. <laughs> mini map Purge. <laughs> Yeah. The next big innovation brought to you by Ooh. Dota Talent. And it looks like we have a, yeah, we have a smoke. So we haven't seen this much. I know Adfinim did it once, and you got to get a first blood with this, or else you lose multiple runes. Go up you and around. You don't get a kill. Yeah, and it looks like they will, but Yellow, he's standing in the, the correct he's spot fast. right now. He's yeah. fast. Oh, God, MSS is so good. He's a fast pony. Yep, he knew yeah. immediately watching his screen. What, and look at the good luck half on comes right after he sees Two him. Two-legged abominations. Love he loves that voice line for good reason. How many two-legged abominations are there? You are one. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> technically just Pudge. But no. no, no. Wait, what? He <laughs> was an abomination in Warcraft 3. That's uh, literally his wrong. model. Uh, uh, he's not wrong. Black, I thought you would have known that. You look confused. I, I, I mean, Come I know on. that, but he doesn't. Yeah. I mean, this is DMZ like Black, so. Kunkka player. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> what? what are you laughing at? <laughs> yeah, what are you laughing at? Your play or yeah, what? Yeah, you should be positive. Uh, dude, that, that was like 10 years ago. That's what we, yeah. I, dude, I've been NA Dota for. DMZ Black. DMZ Black with the Kunkka. <laughs> DMZ oh. Hexor. DMZ Hexor. DMZ Black with the Kunkka. And we have another quick pause. Just kidding. Sorry, Just good. kidding. It looks like, yep, sorry, good. Just a, a quick <laughs> microphone issue. We've sorry, all good. been there. Jeez. You know who got their star playing Kunkka? What? Universe. Did he? Yeah, so it was like. Was you this on the silver tier team? It was like, uh, I was on that team. Oh, you were? Because I remember silver tier being one of the most notorious map hackers of all time. You want to know how that <laughs> happened, by the way? Let me tell you. Yes, I was please. on a team with him, and then uh, this guy named Silver Tier, yeah. and then he ditched me to play with Universe, 
It was like me, Jing, Silver Tier for the longest time. Like we were with team for like three years, and we used to always first pick him Clockwork, yeah. and he was the godliest Clockwork player you've ever seen in your life. And just then, would hit like the yeah. craziest hooks. And then uh, there was, was this site called Dota Licious, yeah. and somebody from Dota Licious, like the owner guy, contacted me and said they knew that Silver Tier was map hacking, and they yep. had the proof. So instantly, without even like, I posted that shit on NA Dota. Expose my ex teammate. Yeah. yeah, I mean it was it was funny because me and Universe we used to hate each other because of that. I said Universe, you were complicit in that. Now of course we're we're, we're pretty good buds, but uh, you know you, you gotta chill. Luckily like we were in Dota too. I now. was the salty. I only exposed him for saltiness, hundred percent. Oh yeah, you got to. Yeah. He left you. <laughs> and now. Is that how we're gonna works? see it. That's I mean we weren't going though. anywhere. We weren't a good team. We were. Just, I thought we were just boys. Yeah. Rage level Just one. trying to play with the homies. Yeah. This is what you get. You just. Casually play some SECS on a Sunday, like win a pizza from Mark Draveland, like. Yep. Nothing like winning a pizza. What a great prize that would be. That is. That's what we should money. pay out for this. Yeah, just yeah. give him a pizza. Someone go tell the teams. Admin, can we have a ruler? Dude, back then it was hype. It was like Mark. W he wasn't a dick either. Like he, he'd actually get you like a large pizza. <sighs> Except hey, <laughs> well, he cool. didn't. But that was drama. So, yeah. <laughs> a lot yeah. of drama in NA, but. We got another slow. When was first blood last game? It was like six or seven minutes in. Oh, yeah. We got, we got lots Legion. of time. Don't yeah, worry. We do. Do you think, is there a better kill light in this game? It feels like that Disruptor is definitely a lot yes. juicier than than other games. He needs to play like the Warlocks that just camp in their tower and heal their carry, except he doesn't heal their carry. He just pathetically throws a Thunderstrike. But if he leaves the safety of the tower, it's just like Burrow Strike, instantly stun, dead. dead. Yeah. Well, once again, CCNC loses refraction to that tower. You gotta be careful. That tiny is level three, the one 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 build, so not the most burst yet. Yeah, most of the damage will be coming from the tower. Yeah, just get that toss back. You never know. Yeah. I mean, he already tossed him back into the tower. Yeah, but yeah, one more course. time, all it takes. Yeah. Of course, like a TA doesn't really care too much because of perfection, but. I think, I mean, this is just kind of how Chaos plays. Like, they're always okay not being aggressive in the lane. They know they'll get CS. It feels like they just know they're going to outplay the enemy team in the mid game right now. They've uh, done the math on the numbers of creep value. Yep. Crunch oh, that shit. Let's not, let's not go back to math. We had lots of that yesterday. Oh, okay. Oh, the stun. Nice dodge there, though. Will be okay Wait, for now. He would have been dead, right? Yeah, I think he would hit fully. And he's going to pop the healing self while he's refracting. He baits him in. He's trying to take it up, but no, Pikachu gets bodied right there. And he has no region left. Yeah, that's rough. That's CC and C abusing that middle lane. You're going to lose the regen war again against the TA. Yeah. yeah. No, instantly oh eats the mango. No. Yeah, this is this is looking rough. Pikachu oh. looked like he might get that kill. Now that he missed it, he's in a lot of trouble. If he, if he had gotten that, he would have had the bottle. His courier is coming, though. Road to road. We do have, it looks like a Marana coming through that bottom river to the mid lane. Spotted by a ward, I believe, though. Yep. Rough. Does have the bottle, so maybe you get to sit around here, go for a four minute rune, bottle it up later. I feel like Chaos's draft is always good. Like, they haven't been out drafted yet this tournament. So they always win the draft. And, uh,. I mean, it's mostly SVG, right? He came back. Is, is it crazy, dude? Like these players, like SVG and Universe, can take like a year off almost, and then just come back and be gods. Like, do you think you could do that, Black? Honestly, like if you take a full year off, like I don't believe SVG even played. He didn't play Dota for like six months. I mean, honestly, it's really hard. Like, if you no. don't play for like actually like an entire year, you have to like relearn a lot of things. Like, you know? every, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's a completely different game. So I don't, I don't know if I could. You need to be kind of like a genius, you know? Yeah, and I would say SVG yeah. genius. Like, is I, I wouldn't say I'm very talented. For me, it comes all through hard work. You know. uh, I thought you were going to say heart. <laughs> that too. <laughs> He's got a big lot heart. Of that. A big heart, yes. We're going to see Creep getting stolen. MSS gets the big one there, and yep, they're just going to finish you want. it off. The big yeah. one. No. Well, this uh, Marana sat down there for a long time and uh, was not able to find a play on the mid lane. Are you saying he's wasting his time? Well, yes and no. I mean, yep. at least he has an ogre, so ogre can still kind of handle himself in the lane and not uh, worry too much. But his his lasts are going to be impacted by that for sure. I mean, I feel like this is like how you you know nice to how you want to draft CK. This is like the perfect CK draft. Right now there's going to be a, a tip on MSS. <laughs> it's it's another one of these games where this position three ogre can do absolutely nothing to the carry. Yeah. Like once you hit level three on Chaos Knight, you just have infinite sustain. Just put ogre middle and ignite the TA. Lul. Boom. Get Orb of Venom. Yeah, Orb of it's, actually, it's actually not bad. Like, you can pressure TA. Where's gonna see? Ida gets popped. Thunder strikes there. It is the five minute rune, so they will zone him out. Well, this is gonna be. They're gonna get three? Almost, yeah, three for yeah. one rune exchange for 178 there. Ton of gold. I mean, it's like. 
How big of a deal is it actually? It's like 250 gold, right? Overall? Something yeah, like it's quite a bit of gold. Yeah. Yep. And a double damage I mean, bottle by the tiny. It's like one CS per player. It's, hey man, that's important when you're. But not it's three the one of them. Creeps. Yeah. Hey man, the tiny is still doing pretty good. You see, they both are level five. He has a, a bottled up double damage, so he could get something done in that mid lane still. So you see, yeah. he'll have to play a little bit more careful. He is going to throw it in. There's going to be the arrow. It hits. Refraction is down. He's bottling up. Has the DD tossed into the air. One more hit. No, Fairy Fire still up. Refraction. Blinding lights here. Refraction's up and. Well, you let the coddle through the draft, and guess yeah. what? The light does blind you. You guys he ever can do it all. Yeah. Have you guys ever stared? I know they tell you not to stare, Don't at, the stare at the sun, but sun, you guys Graham, did, please, right? Please, no. Nobody should stare at the sun. <laughs> what about during, okay, what about well, during, during an like, eclipse? an eclipse? Yeah, you're no, still I, not supposed I to. I had but, the like, cardboard box. Oh, oh there it again. is. Damn, and the first blood comes out. Still had the double damage. There's the tip. I've been to six again. But they do go top lane, and that's a big kill. This might be a double kill. They're going to try to chase after him. Here comes the stun, and it hits oh, on the edge. Pixel. It overcomes Saberlight and the right click. MSS secures them two kills just like that. Yeah. Any impressionable youth, please don't stare into the sun. No, you should. That's what I was going to say. But I'm just saying, if there is an eclipse, you shouldn't. But if you do, you know, it is pretty cool looking. <laughs> <laughs> what? Well, if it, no, if it's the moon in front of the sun. Definitely not sun in front of moon. <laughs> All right. I got you guys. I think it's not like you're that, speaking from like personal experience. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. I, I love those times when the sun gets in front of the moon and it scorches yeah. the earth. Oh That's the God. best time. That's my favorite of the the extinction eclipse. They're just running away. Of this edict. Of all, all right. Let's say like of all the weird conspiracy theories out there, which one do you think could be like? What's the closest to being true? Like the moon landing. Uh, like flat Earth. No, it's Bermuda Triangle. All right, something's going on down there. Something's fishy Area about 51. that water. No, I no, watched no. a lot of Discovery Channel as a child, and they made it seem like the Bermuda Triangle was a pretty serious issue. Loch Ness, Bigfoot, all of those. What's real? Nothing. I don't think. Fake moon landing. I'll, just th I'll think for you, bud. All right. I'll think it out. I know. It feels like one seven eight. They gotta. They gotta think about how they fix this landing stage because top. It's not going terrible. Life Stealer is fourth on that worth, but you look at Saber, like he's already a full thousand gold ahead of this Life Stealer. The TA is having a, a lot more of a struggle this game. A thousand below the tiny now. And oh, Ulti's gonna get popped immediately. There comes the stun. It's a two cent. A blast level one gonna do some damage. Throws out a multicast, hits the coddle. coddle. We have another pullback, and yep, there's gonna be one more easy pullback. Dude, this hero as an offlaner is like if this happened in pubs before any pro games, people would be like, what are you doing? Yeah. Yeah. Why is my ogre just oh. buying Midas? Send back on MSS, but he does get out of tower range, so looks to be pretty okay. This dual is so bad. <laughs> well, now Disruptor's out of mana, and okay, just gonna King's going to skip waves and free farm. Yeah, this looks a little bit rough. Over 1,000 gold lean. This is pretty crazy, because your TA is losing middle, but you're still up 1,000 gold because your side lanes yeah. are going so You want to know the funniest part? It's like they lost the sentry battle top, and they don't care. No cares. Yeah. That's usually yeah, how that's not good. Lanes. That's so. a good right take. They don't give a crap. So what do you do? Who do you want to roll? Obviously, Disruptor's not the best rotating hero. Does this, what, who do you do? Does Zamorana just have to like make plays? Is she yeah. the only one until Tiny gets like a blink or something? I mean, like they kind of have a similar issue again where the Sand King and CK are going to be super tanky soon. And they don't have like the biggest amount of damage on their team. Yep. And now MSS, he knows there's a ward there because it was nighttime and you wouldn't get hit there if there wasn't a ward, so probably gonna get countered. Yeah. Of course, TA, you know, even if you lose lane, you can catch up quite comfortably in the jungle. You can stack for yourself pretty damn easily as well. Yeah. And the Coddle can just take middle because, of course, he's Coddle. Yeah, and last time he was dire TA, now he's Radiant, so he's got uh, the easy. advantage. Yeah, he will just sit in the jungle. Keep out of the light. Man, he keeps that light. He does. <laughs> How much light does he have? He uses so much of it all the time. He's got it all. I mean, right now it's nighttime. He's, he took it. But he still has it. Yeah, he's just holding on to it. Oh, chicken. Keeping Flies it bottom. safe for everybody. Oh, well, five minutes. This CK almost has an armlet. Yeah. And it feels like this This game feels very similar to the last game where both teams uh, feel pretty complacent just farming. Oh, well, that's I believe not that's the a tower. Kill. It is not. And he will just go down this instantly first. There. They're just going to run at him. I feel this tower is probably going down here. I just want to force the TP. Oh. That's fine. Yep. He's gone, he and that is going to be a tower. You have a TA and get a melt. It has that casual Blightstone. I like how Sanking stood there, like in, in case it cancels his TP, you know? Yeah, I'm, waiting. I'm watching you. <laughs> you don't get a deny. Let's see who's going to get it. Oh, no. Oh, Saber nice. Light. Oh, wow. I thought that one range crew was going to get it again. Dude, Saber Light's massive. Yep. There's going to be a. Nope. Don't even need the arrow. Okay. I got the arrow. Yep. Just, Skip, just gets it. Another SPG kill. goes down. And another double damage from the Tiny. So. Getting some nice rooms. 
two legged abomination. Man. Well, yeah. Does Ogre have the Midas delivered yet? Yeah, he does. Without no, boots? He does. Okay, I want to see if. Now he, he has boots, though. I want to see if he gets the multicast, you know. He already uh, did get the multicast. Oh, he. Because his boots, now. Yeah. yeah, I guess he did, yeah. Well, Tome's getting picked up. He needs a lot of multicast. <laughs> he, he just multicasted the Quelling Blade. My god. Did he? Yeah, you can do that. Hell but yeah. it doesn't do anything. You can prime it for the 105% blitz. <laughs> I actually hate you so much. <laughs> Here comes the ah, ulti. This was the Is man. he gonna find him? <laughs> no, that no. Was <laughs> it was. Yeah, There's the instant tip. tip. All right, fair. Uh oh, now gotta be careful. Stun goes out, but Saberlight, he doesn't care. He wants to kill this creep wave. One of them makes it. Mana boot Sand King. Interesting. Oh. So that was Tiny and Marana, and he's still there. Yep. That's a very bad sign for your game. I mean, you, you don't have to damage or kill him, to be honest. Yep, he and can just veil the trees, yeah. get away. Veil Sanking is so tanky. The good news, though, is that the Tiny is having a very good game, he and is. he wrecks these supports. It's a very good news. Like, they finally have Someone a way to, yeah, right yeah. to pressure the Coddle. Damn, gets nice, the two. nice. He needs everyone. How does he mise a creep behind him? He casts it in front of him. It's true. God tier. Power probably of probably the second head. The second head looks back and says, oh, I got this one. <laughs> and 60 vision. All right, Blitz, he's got the blink. So does this Tiny, does he just play off map the rest of the game? Yeah, game? so I think what Tiny actually has to do is tank the Coddle ult. So if he goes in and he can't burst the Coddle ult, the Coddle still has to, like, Blinding Light full kit him yeah. uh, to get away. And if that happens, like, you're okay with that. That's just the trade that you unfortunately have to yep. make. But he can't feed. Like, if he feeds now, it's yeah. lights out. Here we go. They're going to smoke up. And smoke of the seed. The big problem, though, is they have a life stealer that's below a, an ogre right now. Oh, smoke against smoke, but they're in a better position on the side ground. Whoa, they'll see each other. He will get him the blinding lights there. Will it be enough? The combo is enough. They're going to go for nice stun out there from Saberlight. He will leave away on that Marana. How are they going to turn this one around? CK's here now. They want to get this tiny. Tiny will definitely go down. Do you run up hill? Hell yeah. You yeah. do chaos. They're looking, but no detection will be there. And a, a oh. one for one. And... The tiny goes oh. down. They're gonna take mid tower with this, yeah. so it's 100% yeah. worth it. I mean, disruptor, like his first level six play, he hit nothing yeah. with his ult. At, I, I thought he hit the Moran. I'm like, oh, Moran's yeah. good. I'm like, wait, that's, that's teammate. teammate. Oh teammate. shit, how do you leap out? Oh boy. It was, it was defensive trying to help uh, versus the left rack. And going back to what Black said, how Chaos hasn't lost a draft. Like, think about it. They always have like really good team fight, and it's the tower team, right? Even just like the left rack, they always yep. check off those boxes. Mm -hmm. They needed to. Uh, Help the tiny out there a little bit more. Yeah, it feels like they didn't really commit until too late. And then, as you said, the disruptor misses the old. Well, you yeah. don't really have much. I mean, if you're a position five disruptor and you miss your old, you're basically a creep. Yeah. Yeah, your level one thunder strike. Uh, <laughs> lightning. Damage. It's like Harry Potter in the first movie. What? Uh, you know, now I'm going back to your conspiracy. How did we discover electricity? It was that one guy with the key, right? Yeah. And the, that the one guy who was a grand. Benjamin Franklin. There right? it is. But, like, what happened? So he just put a kite up, and then it, like, and then we have light bulbs? That sounds pretty made up. Yeah. Uh, it was probably aliens. It could they be. They probably taught him how to do it, and he had to come up with some bullshit story. So I had this kite. I didn't even know All that right. this was a conspiracy theory. Like, I was thinking I think he's making one up right now. I see. I, well, how uh, – would you ever think about flying a kite to charge a light bulb? Yeah. Was no? it like key in a bottle? I don't yeah. think it was. I don't know. I thought it, maybe I'm thinking of like the Mother Goose story. I don't know. <laughs> it's a good question. <laughs> what? There's going to be the stun dust. He did have refraction, wow. so he will tank a lot of. There's going to be the ulti, and this time they should be able to bring him. There's a <laughs> lot of heroes. All right, all right. All right. That's good. All right, guys, he's dead. Yeah. Big place. We got him this time. Dude, he tanked the whole One thing. One guy there. clapped. Yeah. All right. We have a very biased crowd. All right. Yeah, it's in NA. We never get lands! Try and let him have it! USA! All right, all right, all right. USA! Sorry, cool. I got hyped. You know I'm NA too, right? The NA is yeah. North America. No, you don't count. We nah. all, we all You're count. good. Canada and Mexico always getting forgotten. We do. And they're, they're going to try to bring him down. It is the Life Stealer. Just pops the rage, open wounds, gets out of there. He has an armlet as well. If you start that chant, like, no matter where you are, and you go loud enough and enthusiastic enough, people will follow you. Hell yeah, yeah. dude. I love the USA chant. That's like yeah. my favorite chant that exists. Is dude, it? Dude, I love yeah, like it kills me. The at TI in, uh, at Key Arena, I think, when it's yeah. always China against USA. China, China, USA. Dude, it, is I, yeah. right. it was real loud there. Yeah. Just battling each other. We went to USA. 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 See, you just oh, people yeah. will do it. Like they didn't even coordinate that. They just somebody started That's and true. everyone. Did I remember? I, I was sitting on like, oh, wait, we are gonna see a rune fight here. Life stealer gonna be okay. That is well, an old from the CK, but yeah. disruptor with that zone. 
Felt pretty good. Was that a four for four rune? Yeah. Or did Teal get one of them? Okay. Huh? All right. One seven eight. I went to a. Uh, four. Wow. We went to a Chargers game this past weekend against the Packers with uh, Milk. Yeah. And I've never Milk. heard such like patriotism at all times. Like. Oh uh, yeah. Football look, dog, come on! No, nah, they they played the um, you know God bless the USA, yeah. which is like the most offensive song in every other country. Like, you know, it's like I'm proud to be a, an American, where at least I know I'm free. It's so <laughs> passive aggressive. <laughs> and he was just like, "Wait, are these actually the lyrics?" We're like, "Yeah." Everyone's singing it. He's <laughs> looking around confused. Of all the places you really need to boast about your nationalism, it's America versus America playing yes. American Hell football. Yeah. <laughs> come on, guys. Let's rally around America. It was so I, I felt really bad because then like, the jets flew over and Dude, we have those. I know. Those are real things that happen. Yeah. America, fuck yeah. You know that song? Yeah. yeah. If you want that feeling black, go to an NFL game. <laughs> Pretty much any sports, honestly. Baseball as well, yeah, we'll hit you up there too. I kinda feel like NFL but, might be the most egregious. Yeah. Yeah. Basketball is okay, right? Basketball's pretty global. Basketball's pretty chill, you know. Yeah. They got yeah. the, the DJ playing, some yeah. music bumping. All right. Definitely more chill. Good. So good. We do have a, it looked like they were going to smoke, but not quite yet. They're just going to stand. Look at that. Trap sees all form. He has to know it is a bait in there. It's going to be the old from Keeper Life. The rest don't have to get out. It is a nice trap there from the Disruptor, <laughs> but it won't matter. Pikachu goes down. They don't have the damage. They're going to try to run him. Saber Light. He gets the stun before he gets sent back. Well done. This is going to be two more. And my God, chaos. They just look like on a whole nut. They, they don't. They legitimately rush, don't no. take bad fights. Ever. No, they don't. I mean, they. It's crazy I, to me. I don't think they understand Disruptor. I'm sorry. There's no way Disruptor was a pick this game. I, I think that the Disruptor's okay if you have another initiating hero with Tiny. Yeah. But because you have Offlane Ogre, he walks forward. Yeah. That's That's I mean, it. he needs very specific partners. You know what this reminds me of, Grant? Remember when we were when Yumi and Cap were casting the NA calls and we saw uh we saw Darkseer every game and it kept losing we're yeah. like it was literally like one in eleven, I think. Yeah. yeah. But people just kept doing it. It was like Darkseer, Spirit Breaker, and then every time Spirit Breaker didn't have Darkseer, it'd win. It's very odd. There's going to be CC and Sir Quinn, pardon me. Why, why do you just... itemize into armlet if you're not playing to fight at all? Well, like, it looked like they were playing to fight. Yeah, they, yeah, but, they but, lost two fights. No, no but Lifestealer was his bot lane all the time. Like, he wasn't even joining mid fight. He was at the mid fight, wasn't he? No, he no. wasn't. Oh. You wanted him to go Midas? Midas Rat? No, I mean, like, but if you itemize for armlet, you gotta make use of it, you know? Yeah. Uh, you, you don't just farm with armlet. I also really like Midas Radiance against uh, CK. Oh, yeah. I, don't, I don't think they have the time, though. Okay, against like. as well. No, but the thing is, like, if you build armlet and you farm, then might as well just build Midas Radiance. Yes. You know? No, 100%. And, and that scales way better. Do you like this Maelstrom pickup on Lifestealer? <laughs> no. Is it just, I mean, what's it for? Does he think it'll clear the CK? It just feels, it, it does feel very weird. It's because yeah. it, once you've gone armlet, you don't really have another choice. I mean, yeah. you could go armlet radiance if you really want to, but it's kind of weird. slower, yeah. yeah it's kind of weird. And here we go. There's going to be a blink by a tiny, but just to get this tower. <laughs> right on that tower. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> We're going in. You got me hyped. I get it. I did. Yeah. They're just going to. Can you hype me up for this tower, too? I would love, only if they're going to bring it down. I'll hype you up for this arrow. He's going to shoot it forward. Oh, does hit the CK. The connection. That came out of nowhere. That's not yeah. all he can do. And look at this. Split pushing two tier two towers, C, C, and C middle. The other two top. And yeah, that tier two top's yeah. probably just going to fall. Usually means you're Psych? in a pickle <laughs> if you get pushed Indeed. like that. In a pickle. Well said. In a pickle. Yeah. Well, now the tower is going to go down. Definitely no glyph. He'll take another, <laughs> he takes another He's one. saving it for the creep. Yeah. You know, I got you. That's how you know when you're ahead. Get when you down. get to make this move and you don't get punished at all. Yeah. yeah. And that shows that you also don't have like the best initiation aside from this tiny but, like he's your most farm hero you oh. don't want to hard commit him uh Bro. yeah he's a little bit of position he is gonna send him back but he didn't send him all the way he is still in the bottom lane yet reality rips him back and they might just get a, a two for oh here maybe not pikachu's trying to get out he's looking now can i bring down svg he does he's gonna go down at least he gets something out of it but uh-oh the disruptor he gets bopped on the head once stone man yeah and this is just Two for one and a whoa, okay. An invis life stealer. Yeah, I mean, you can maybe kill this guy, but you're not getting out. Yeah. Let's see. Uh oh, middle leg. Whoa, Mike. Ooh, Wait, isn't right, that nice a core ogre? I believe it was, and he gets body. Oh, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Is he just getting it right quick? Down? You can arm it while you're doing okay, that, and he does good. make it out. And it, it feels bad because he. You can tell the life still feels like he needs to make a play yes. like that, but it doesn't even connect, doesn't even get the kill. I mean, he didn't even try because he was just seen by a sentry wall. Yeah. Yeah. And uh oh. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, I want the, the bounty rune. And, well, he didn't and even get it. Quinn got, got the bounty rune and the kill. 
Jeez. This is just feeling like a... They do have one more kill than they did last game, though. So That's things good. are looking up. A little bit better. Always an optimist. The Dota is so weird, man. Like, it's even for the longest time, you know, and then two minutes, suddenly, like, 6k. Just like that. And then 10k. I've seen about tanking an air for the creep. Who would you guys tank a bullet for? Would you? For yeah. anyone? As yeah. a person or what? Yeah, as a person. I'd do it for a few people. Who? Yeah, for sure. Like, okay, you have to exclude family, though. Okay. That's... Because that's an easy cop Can't out, right? Name people. The U.S. president. Yeah. Is there anybody in Dota you would cop a bullet for, Trent? Like, am I gonna die? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, you don't know. You're done. You don't know. That's the thing. You don't you know where it'll hit. Okay. Like, like you jump, and it could hit you. It's anywhere. not very. Yeah, it's not very. If it grazes your thigh, then it wasn't very heroic. Like, <laughs> That, that, that I feels, it's pretty heroic. Dude, I got responsibilities at home. I feel like you guys are willing to take one for me. So you got zero. Me. That's zero. Yeah, that's zero. That's a zero for him. It could hit your head. Yo, give me, you know, Black, what about a couple you? months, maybe. Let me think. I mean, Daryl and I, like, Ice as Ice, we are really close. So okay. It, it might be him. And he has family, too, you know? So That's one. Grant? Yeah. yeah. Sue Mail. You got to protect NA Dota. If I'm going to go down, <laughs> I got to protect the sanctity <laughs> of NA Dota. And they're going to try to team fight here. There's going to be another stun toss combo with the tiny campers. Then he went down. Doesn't even look like the CK's taking damage. There's going to be multiple ulties from the Radiant. They bring down the Ogre. They're pushing <laughs> forward for more. Will they get him? Well, they sure as hell will. They're just diving the base. CC and C. Kill after kill. They want Saber everybody. Light wants more. Bingham, can he leap up the hill? No. He leaps to the side and he will make it away. Stuns up, doesn't get it. He will pro caustic again, though. I mean, this Bottom lane, they're losing their base. The yep. stupid cuddle, old man. It's just there. Nobody ever tries to Whoa, kill whoa, CCNC. Whoa. Dives again, and that is a 4 for 0. And Ogre, he buys back, but. I'm not sure there's much he can do. Yep, and yeah. it is the, the Sumail build again. It's just armless straight into it. that. They caught. Oh so they my. got one God. more kill. If you combine their KD, nine their kills. kills, they got nine kills in two Single games. Single digits. Single digits. That was that was a straight up beat down of both games. Were you, I mean, we thought. I mean, we talked yesterday at the end, after the end of the panel. We were talking like who looks like the favorite. And a lot of people said a one seven eight. They thought they were up there with IG and Chaos, and now. Doesn't look like they were. I mean, they had some good games. They they showed off with some like fancy heroes. I know like the the Greeks were talking them up. They really liked a lot of what they were doing, but not so much in these games. Yeah, so I, I don't think it's their play to be honest. It's just a draft Coddle. was so bad. It's just Coddle, right? Almost. I mean, which is the draft, but like, I like think their own heroes were just pretty yeah non both games yeah. as well. It just makes no sense to draft. The, the Coddle makes it harder, but like I don't know how you make moves with these heroes. Yeah, you, you don't. I mean, we started that series at nine. Right now, it's I just checked. It's ten thirty. <laughs> Like we actually an hour and a half BO3. Damn. <laughs> an hour and a half BO3. Man, we, we better slow down. Either. The players won't be awake yeah, to even, on the couch. We even had, like, break time. We chilled. Yeah. We had some audience interaction. Like, it wasn't even a fast. No. So, are you? is Chaos just the overwhelming favorite now? Are you guys going to still wait for the next series to, to really decide? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to wait. I haven't gotten to see too much IG. When I have seen them, they did look strong. Yeah. yeah. Except yesterday, they're kind of sloppy. And well, they had one sloppy. J178 yeah. gave... <laughs> Gave them a lot of comfort heroes. Yeah, they did. And now it was straight because once that they looked real good against IG yesterday and then today. I mean, we are in bracket now, so you know a lot more is on yeah. the line officially. And we are gonna wait for the the chaos players. You know, get a couple of them up here. You know, explain some stuff. Everyone needs to think of a question. Everyone now. Oh, and well, I already well, called the blink dagger Quinn. It, it, it doesn't matter. We can ask Damn, them what they think. That's harsh. Yeah, just stealing it away. Right, just give me the first question. Then. No, I got it. Uh, nah. dude, that one's easy. Okay, I won't do it. All right, oh, we got Saber Light here line. again. The, the Sand one. King himself. Hello, guys. My Hi. friend, that was a quick series. I mean, what can I say? There was, like, not not much to be done, you know, this series. Whoa. Yeah, there was just went for the went for the throne. You did. I mean, you guys played amazingly. You got your Sand King you love playing. and You guys just dominated. Were, were you surprised they gave you Keeper of the Light twice? Uh, a bit, to be honest, but I, I'm sure they had some some idea against it, and you know, I guess it didn't work. Yeah, it did not. That was a 22-minute game, yeah. an absolute beatdown. Blitz, you said you had a very important question. What are your you thoughts on offlane ogre? <laughs> offlane ogre. Um, I used to play it in the past, and like the the Midas is pretty good, but I don't know. I don't like it that much now. I don't think it's that strong. Because like the hero. I don't know. It's like the hero basically has one stun and bloodlust, and that's it. Yeah. Yep. Black. All right. Um, since you took my question, I'll just ask, where are you holding back in the group stage? Cause 
You just dismantled them so they hard. They were undefeated in the group stage. Yeah, what the yeah, hell are you yeah. saying? No, but I mean, they were undefeated. You were really undefeated. put him on the spot here, dude. <laughs> he yeah. didn't no, come equipped. No, no, they Poor were black. undefeated, you know, but... I know. They, they wasn't that dominant. Yeah, they, they weren't that dominant. So, you know, were you holding some strats back? I or? mean, we still have, you know, something up our sleeves. Oh, so yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Wait for that first loss. Makes yeah. sense. They've yeah. got all the sleeved hoodies, you know. Yep. That's, that's where they keep everything. Oh, okay. I've been told that we actually have a question from the audience. Uh, instead of my question, because they wanted something of higher intelligence, Slacks. <laughs> Hello, we're doing audience <laughs> questions. I'm here with Devo. Devo, a question for Saberlight. Don't be weird. All right, all right. <laughs> so I've been watching your performances uh, this tournament. You look pretty good. I'm just wondering, how many games do you have to win in order to get signed on the team permanently? Oh, you were weird. <laughs> Take a seat. Sign, signed by who? By Chaos? By Chaos, yeah. yeah. Well, I feel like I was thinking about it, and I think if we win this and we go to the to the major, yep. then they... They have? I mean, they, they kind of have to, because they're going to lose DPC points, you know? <laughs> <laughs> well, we do see Chaos as the uh, owner over uh, there. He's yeah. agreeing <laughs> with this currently. No, uh, but it's true. You you played amazingly and mm -hmm. absolute dominating in the offlane. Trent, you didn't yeah. get away. What's your question? Well, I actually wanted to harp more on the offlane ogre okay. as well, but do, uh, you can do no, it. No, no, you can. You uh, can. Well, I guess uh, I, I would say like, did you feel like they had a really hard time making moves this series? Because it felt like you guys got to dictate the pace of like the entire series. Like they never had heroes that could like do stuff. Um, I feel like just Quinn and SVG are really good at Dota, so like yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't know, we didn't feel pressured at all to like make any moves and yep. if we if we like made a move it was usually a good one because like we these guys just like know how to play Dota so I feel like they just like we just have a better understanding of the game and like where we move map movement and stuff like that so I mean it's really hard for them to play the game if they like don't know what they're doing yep and well last question before we let you go who, well, I guess it's two. Who do you want to play against later today in the Winners' Bracket Finals, and who do you think you're going to play against? Uh, Hellraisers or IG? The, I mean, we, I guess we want to play Hellraisers since we already won against yep. them, but I feel like it's going to be IG. Okay. So we'll see. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we're going to win either way. So. Damn, nice. I love that confidence nice. on the NA team. NA yeah. confidence. Thank you very much, Saberlight. It's Thank always you. great to hear from you. Good yes, luck. Have uh, fun watching the, the game. The crowd were big fans. They cheered very loudly for everything you guys did. Yeah, they awesome. love it. And he gives them, yes. Thank you very much. And this stuff, Saberlight, he's, he's been on the couch. He's done many of the interviews. He's the new player on the team. He's Nice. Not NA, yeah. yeah he was on the well couch spoken. with us. That's what yeah. I mean. He's doing. He's doing everything. Where the hell's? Where the hell's everyone else? MSS, <laughs> huh? Oh shit, he's right there. Oh, Yo, never shit. mind. Oh, my shit. bad. I was just lying. We love you. <laughs> Jesus Christ, gonna beat my ass. No, but that is the end of series number one. As you saw, a very, very quick series. But the dota's not done. We got three more. The next matchup, it's Hellraisers. It's IG. We're gonna get into it right now. Just kidding. A short break is coming up, and we will see you guys after that.